guys welcome back to the channel so first of all just log in with your credentials and once you're done with this just simply come back over here click on this checkbox and click on agree and continue now just wait for a second then click on activate cloud shell and just activate your cloud shell because we need on task number two just simply click on continue now just simply search for the cloud function open this thing in new tab okay come back over here now just simply come on the task number one and here just copy this name for your cloud function click on this create function and here just replace the name like this no need to make any other changes just simply click on save and here click on this down arrow and here you can see maximum number of instance just make it five and then click on next no need to make any other changes just simply click on deploy and you are done with the task number one now what you have to do just simply search for the api gateway and just simply come over here and here you can see api gateway open this thing in new tab now i request you please pay attention because this task might be tricky for you just simply click on launch just wait and then click on enable now it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile what you have to do just come over here if you want you can use this arc number or other you can use the lab name so just copy this arc number go to my telegram channel the link is in description box just come over here in the search bar just type hashtag arc number and here you will get one file okay just download this yml file to a local system once you're done with this now just simply scroll down to task number one task number two okay what we have to do just simply click on this create the gateway and for the display name copy this display name carefully make sure you do not copy any extra space make sure of that thing copy the name just paste over here again scroll down here you can see display name again paste the same name and at last again here paste the same name okay now for the api id i will share this command in description box and i already shared this command on my telegram channel also from here you can just copy or you can just copy from the description box of this video just copy this command go to dashboard and run the command over here and here you will get api id so just copy this api id make sure you do not copy an extra space is the api id over here okay now we have to upload one file so just simply click on this browse and just upload that file which you just downloaded from my telegram channel okay so it's done now for the service account make sure you have to choose the compute engine service account always you have to choose this compute engine now scroll down for the location just choose the us central one make sure your configuration must look like this for gateway if it's so just simply click on create now gateway is going to take five to ten minutes to create okay now what we have to do just simply search for the pub sub okay just simply search for the pub sub and open this thing in new tab come back over here wait for a second meanwhile just simply go back to lab instruction come on the task number three and just copy this name as a topic id just copy this name click on this create topic and here just paste the name and make sure you have tick on this checkbox for default subscription once you're done with this just simply click on create now just wait for a couple of seconds and our pub sub is created now please pay attention what we have to do here you can see package.json just copy this code go back to the cloud function okay here just simply click on this edit option just wait scroll down click on this next and here you can see package.json just remove this code with new okay now again scroll down now here you can see index.js just copy this code click on this replace this code with this and make sure your index.js line number must be have 15 lines okay now just simply click on deploy and once our cloud function will get update we will get a score on task number three and once our api is, will be create we will get a score on task number two so just wait for a couple of seconds and then we are done with the task number three also just wait
and as you can see after a couple of seconds our cloud function is, will be updated now if i just simply come back to task number three and click on check my progress i will get a score without any issue and if i just go to task number one and click on this check my progress i will get a score without any issue but task number two we have to spend around 10 minutes okay so just wait and once 10 minutes will be over i will get a score on this task as well okay so just wait and let's see And as you can see, it's done. Now, if I just simply come back over here and click on this check my progress, I will get a score without any issue. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please let me know in the comment section, guys. Thanks for watching and have a good day.